I'm Susan and today is the day after my 56th birthday and I've been looking back over the last year and what I have found really stands out a mile is that your vision of success is it's already influencing other people so to say success is influencing other people it's so true and yet you don't actually realize how far at that time that is happening. So yes, I have spent a few minutes evaluating my year. And what I've come to realize most is that sometimes you need a break from all decisions. So you stop, you wash, you rinse, wash, start again, you stop and you recharge. And then you go forward. And one big decision that comes from the heart will do more good than decisions based on fear and impatience. The laws of the universe, the universal laws, they talk about vibrancy and energy and bringing your inner child out and having that curiosity. Number four. And I was thinking, since your vision, your dream of success is already influencing other people, then why not take time to look at your support network, the, vo mo the motivation that drives you, even the inspiration and inspirations that are behind and front. These are all something that helps you create your success. And like I said, when you are moving along those stepping stones, and even those sub-stepping stones making a stepping stone, and then you leap from that to the next and the next, you are taking people along with you. You just can't help it. They are going to be attracted to your energy, yourself, your friends. They're going to come in because that energy is something so, so very precious. And it's given to you not as you yourself, as an individual. It's loaned to you. And when you see other people responding negatively, positively, whatever it is, take that step back. Look at where they're coming from. Deal with the issue that you've got an issue, an issue to deal with. Isolate it, take it to pieces if you have to, but deal with that. Because not dealing with it will build up and will create a block. And it's not a building block, it's a stumbling block because if you look at a wall, there's a wall and there's a block in the middle of that wall and it's not quite as well defined as the rest of the wall or the mortar if it's holding an important piece of, and everything around the block is important if it's holding, because it is holding that important piece the rest of the foundations of what you're building they are supportive, they are necessary and they are requiring that little block so if it's, if it's blocking sorry about the sun, if it's not allowing the energy to keep flowing through because it needs work and you're ignoring it it's going to have a hickey fit and crumble and when that happens you've got to go back and really really sort out what is and has happened to influence that crumbling and you then have to take it out dust the corner and repaint it and that's going to take a lot of work. You 
change your mind state, you have already started on your path of the sixth state. And the sixth place, just have a beautiful day, have a wonderful life, come and join the vibration. Enjoy just the feeling of being part of something. And it flies here. <laughs> oh. So you enjoy, you see, you act, you have fun, take up a lot of people along with you. Thank you.